Now, as I finish the story in 30 seconds, she gave birth to an important child. His name is Esau. And there are some fundamental beliefs we have about him that I'll share really quickly. Number one is we believe that he had no father. That his creation with God was like the creation of Adam. Number two, we believe that he's one of the greatest prophets, Ulul Azam in Islam. Number three, we believe that he gave glad tidings of Muhammad. As mentioned in the Quran. Number four, we believe that he taught absolute tawheed. Says in the fifth chapter of the Quran, whoever associates partners with God on the voice of Isa, on his words quoting him, they will not enter paradise. And God says in the Quran, وَلَا تَقُولُوا ثَلَاثَ إِنْتَهُوا خَيْرًا لَكُمْ إِنَّمَا إِلَاهُكُمْ إِلَاهُ وَاحِدٌ In the fourth chapter of the Quran, it says, leave off saying that God is one of three, he's only one. We believe also that he wasn't killed, but it was his likeness. As mentioned in the Quran, وَمَا قَتَلُوهُ وَمَا صَلَبُوهُ وَلَكِنْ شُبِّهَ لَهُمْ The last is we believe he will, he will return. وَإِنَّهُ عِلْمُ السَّاعَةِ فَلَا تَمْتَرُنَّ بِهَا وَاتَّبِعُونَ In the 43rd chapter of the Quran, he says that Jesus is a sign for the last hour.